challenge to a decision of the Judicial and Legal Services Commission. In 2012, a complaint was made to the Judicial and Legal Services Commission about Justice Awich. The complaint was that the, the Judicial and Legal Services Commission ought to exercise its powers under the Belize Constitution to consider whether there was a sufficiently serious allegation of misbehavior and or inability against Justice Awich. And if it found that there was a sufficiently serious case made out to refer the matter to the Belize Advisory Council, who would then investigate whether the judge ought to be removed. The Judicial and Legal Services Commission did not refer the complaint. It, in effect, dismissed the complaint and said the complaint was premature and misconceived because it raised complaints against the judge while he was a Supreme Court judge and the judge was now a Court of Appeal judge. We have sought uh, to ch challenge that by bringing a public law action, saying that the Judicial and Legal Services Commission got it wrong, that there are certain tests to be applied, that once there is a sufficiently serious material before the court, then, sorry, not before the court, before the commission, then it ought to refer it. It's not the commission's job to determine whether the complaint is true or not. It's, once there's sufficient material, then it ought to refer the complaint. Among many other things, we pointed out in this case that there were judgments, a number of judgments from the Court of Appeal, in which judgments of justice of which were criticized in a severe manner, and that, along with everything else, constituted bar association resolutions, etc., constituted sufficient material for there to be a further investigation as to whether the conduct complained of amounted to inability or misbehavior.